here for another long review video from this new location hope you like these new paints I've been working on this new location for a while and uh, I bought these fantastic proper acrylic paints from a from a local painter and this is what we all should do we should support local artists as much as we can and especially in this current situation you know we never know what's going on and when are we going to be able to get our life back you know I've all, all my gigs cancelled or moved to next year so no income from playing music playing beautiful Santana and playing blues with my band you know so this is what you should all do guys please support your local artists your local musicians your local painters your local just support them <laughs> and I'm drinking this Prosecco tonight because my beautiful baby daughter is three months old today <laughs> I'm sure if if you follow me on my channel, you know that it was it's a crazy story. She was born in the middle of the pandemic, and we worried a lot because you know thousands of people died when she decided to come to this planet. And uh, fortunately, everything works. Everything is all right, and uh, she is beautiful and healthy. And uh, here you go for my lovely Nina Poliak. <laughs> three months old and I fought to mamma mia <laughs> what a difference so guys the star of the show tonight the star of the show tonight is this the star of the show tonight 2017 Gibson Les Paul traditional made in USA honey burst and uh, it's got very interesting specs for this year you know burst buckers one and two burst bucker one burst, uh, burst bucker one burst bucker two pickups orange drop capacitors so the orange drop capacitors have to maintain a very healthy sound even when you turn the volume down on the guitar and this is what happened in the intro the amp is the gain stage uh, on the amp is cranked and the guitar is turned down almost on 
on one or two so very very done and it sounds beautiful could you hear it it's very healthy rich sound it doesn't lose too much it, it lose a bit of presence and trouble but not too much and it it's it's interesting it turns it to a bit middle range uh, sound and i really like it so this this model this 2017 model has got these uh, orange drop capacitors what uh, Gibson only put into the very expensive his historic Les Pauls in the past but now they are available uh, in this model the normal stop tail please nothing major here the same uh, <coughs> the same uh, yeah the same tuners what what they have on the historic range uh, it's not a VOS finish so it's 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 a it's a gloss finish it's a beautiful honey burst finish actually it's beautiful and they say it's a double a top but check the pictures out on my website you know this guitar looks fantastic and the flame top is amazing quiet well book matched and uh, very nice chunky flames so if they say these are triple a maple i would i would I, I, I believe it because they look amazing uh, yes very nice low action beautiful action on this guitar beautiful fretwork beautiful neck not not a bad thing that not is a nylon not what not what I'd replace if, if this was my guitar I think I'd replace the nut to bow nut just to make it period correct I think bow nut would sound better for for a guitar like this <clears throat> and I, I prefer that on acoustic guitars so I bet they make a huge difference on electric guitars as well quite dark very dark fretboard to be honest this is a very nice dark rosewood fretboard on this guitar uh, everything else is just the same and this guitar is absolutely in this guitar is in absolute spotless mint condition there's not a mark on it there's no dings dance or buckle rush or anything it's it's absolutely absolutely mint condition zero fretware so this guitar hasn't been played at all three years old and it's like a new guitar it still sm smells new as well but the most important it sounds and plays great uh, in terms of white, uh, these Les Paul traditionals are not too, how do you say, these are not white relieved guitars, so the white is around eight and a half, I bet. I haven't measured it yet, I haven't put it on the scale yet, but I think it's around eight and a half. Uh, yeah, definitely not more than nine because it's not a heavy guitar. Uh, Quite interesting the neck shape. They I checked it on the on Gibson's website and they say it's a rounded 50s rounded neck shape, but it's quite thin. So the previous generations of uh, Les Paul traditionals have had a much much chunkier, thicker neck. This one has quite nice and this is much thinner neck. So it's definitely not a baseball bat style neck it's 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 i think it's even smaller than a historic 58 there's a historic 58 and i think this neck is a just a tiny bit thinner so yeah nothing dramatic so if you after a, after a, a very thin uh, fast playing comfortable neck uh, then check, check these guitars out you don't have to buy the standard one for 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 a comfortable uh, uh, thin neck anymore because this is very thin so yeah let's play let's play something else again but before i play you know make my playing smoother i need to drink this prosecco <laughs> for nina poliak three months old tonight <laughs> or today <laughs> yes my beautiful queen, she is three months old. <laughs> Let's play again something. <laughs> Thank you. 
think it sounds really good. How do you like it, guys? Let me know in the comment section. How do you like this Gibson Les Paul traditional? I think you can play anything on it because it's a marvelous guitar. Great weight, amazing neck, and I really like this un this unpainted back when you can see the nice, beautiful grain of the wood. Great guitar, great, great guitar. How do you like the sound? guitar this is guys it's fantastic guitar and I think it's time it's time to drink a bit of Prosecco for Rando Smith Rando Smith from Mesa Boogie and all the guys at Mesa Boogie this is this is the daddy I think this is the daddy. what a sound what a sound with, with this keeps on Les Paul traditional it just it just it just blows my mind or oh, that anytime I just plug guitar into this amplifier it's a fucking celebration it's a celebration of rock music it's a celebration of proper guitar playing proper guitar sound that's serious that's serious guys hope you enjoy it <laughs> I enjoy this Prosecco actually for Nina Poliak the three months old beautiful my little queen I know, I know in England people call their daughter a little princess, but I call her little queen because there's not nothing above the queen and there's nothing above to me than that little baby. She is fantastic. She sings like this guitar. <laughs> she cries like this guitar. <laughs> Let me know how you like it. I, I love it. 
I love it. Burst Bucker pickups. I always like them. I like them in the previous generation of the historic Les Pauls, and I really like them in this traditional as well. Great, great guitar. It just delivers that juicy, fat Les Paul sound. And I don't know what happened with the capacitors or the volume pots or anything. The guitar is turned down to three and four on the volume, and it just sings like a bird, and it doesn't lose any of the quality. And it, any quality, it's great. <laughs> flute sound it has this very beautiful beautiful flute sounding neck pickup so this is the neck pickup the tone is open and uh, the volume is only on three and it has this beautiful character <laughs> I think it delivers the, the Gary Moore sound only on, let's try five, so volume on five, neck pickup and... <laughs> Did you like this video? Send me a like. Please subscribe. Send a like to little Nina Poliak, who is three months old today, and I drank all the Prosecco for her, <laughs> and I played all the guitar licks and everything for her tonight. So bye bye, bye bye.